Our Wellness Wednesday continues. We head back to the gym with fitness expert Jay Moore. This time we're focusing on back and bicep workouts to strengthen your upper body. All right, hey everybody, we are back in the gym with fitness expert Jay Moore, and we're gonna be highlighting a couple of different areas to work out with. This time, it's our back and our biceps today, right? Right, we want to make sure that our upper body feels just as good as our lower body. A lot, oftentimes, excuse me, we neglect our upper body because we just wanna have legs of steel, but we are gonna get that upper body to match that lower body. Okay. All right, so our first move, you wanna also grab your weights. You can either go light or heavy. If you don't use weights, you can also use water bottles. So we are gonna do bicep curls with a static hold. And what that means is you literally just hold the weight here. Palms out, ready, let's go. Five, four, three, two, and one. You wanna switch arms hold and palms out and five, four, three, two, and one. Now we are gonna do them both together. Palms out, let's go. And five, four, three, two, and one. Now let's focus on our back and do rows. You wanna have that weight at your hip bend over slightly, extend that arm out, and go to the hip. Five, four, three, two, and one. Put it down and let's switch. Make sure that you are using your arms. You don't wanna do any kind of jerking motion. Control that weight. Three, two, and one. Stand up, shake it out. We're gonna do them both now, you ready? Bend over slightly, and let's go. Five, four, three, two, and one. Make sure you are squeezing those shoulder blades together. Now we're gonna go straight back, both weights at the same time, so we're gonna bend over slightly, straight arm kick back. Ready? Let's go. Five, four, three, two, and one. And the key is to really use your arms. You don't want to just swing. You really want to take it in a controlled motion. If you find yourself swinging, you may want to drop the weight a little, a little too heavy. <laughs> All right, so we are going to drop the weight. Okay. We're going to do one of my favorites, which is the Superman. So we're going to lay on our mat, face down, and we're just going to lift arms and legs up at the same time, like we're flying. Ready? And we're gonna do this for 10. Ready, let's go. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. While we're down here, let's do Ooh. one more. Let's do a swimmer. Oh, okay. So we're gonna swim, ready? <laughs> let's go. 10, nine, Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Will you call this the Aquaman? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> and we have back and biceps today, guys. Okay, that was a good workout. Yeah. yeah. Those Supermans kill me every time. Uh, I yeah. Something about them. Aquaman's not too uh, great <laughs> I know, uh, harder so than it looks. How many sets, how many repetitions should you do? I'm a time person, so we do 30 to 45 seconds. I'm depending on your fitness level, two to three sets. You can pump it up to four. Okay, and if you need to lower the weight, is that okay? Lower the weight, yep. Exactly, all right, great. And remember, no weights, water bottles. Water bottles. Anything around the house. Water bottles, body weight, anything, just get moving. Okay, sounds good. Jake, thanks so much. Thank you. <laughs> Aquaman was tougher than Superman. You <laughs> I'm just, for me, anyway. I don't know about anybody else. It's kind of, uh, no, Every it's, time I'm doing the Superman, I just feel like I'm a dead fish, and I'm like, uh, <laughs> like I don't know. Well, it, you can feel it, though. You can feel the burn. Oh, absolutely. If anytime Jay comes, you can feel the burn. And like she said, if you need to lower your weight, it's okay to do so. I've had to lower my weight before. Worked for us, right? Yeah. Okay.